I was really not expecting them to close school this week. Um, I know there was a lot of stuff about the coronavirus all over Arkansas and, you know, in the toilet paper and stuff, but, um, yeah, I really wasn't expecting that. And the worst thing about my situation is just the resistance to do work. It's really hard to do work whenever you're not in a school environment because, you know, you just want to do whatever else, you know, you normally do on the weekends and things. The best part about the situation is I can work on whatever I want to work on whenever I want to work on it. Like through Zoom, I mean, they take roll, but you don't have to, like, it usually only lasts about five minutes, and then you leave the Zoom, and you do whatever you want. So I can work on any of the stuff that I want to work on, whenever I want to work on it. Everyone's going to be exposed to it at some point, and everyone's going to have to build up an immunity to it by getting the coronavirus. But hopefully, like, you know, over time, they'll find some ways to prevent it from being so bad, or you know, or find vaccines for it or whatnot, so it won't be as threatening as it is at. Right now, the whole situation's a little bit chaotic, and it's kind of confusing, you know, um, compared to what it'd normally be, but in the end, um, we'll eventually get this figured out. Like, I make sure to wash my hands when, when I go into the place and when I leave the place every time. So if I were to go to Walmart, for example, I would wash my hands after I left or use Germex or something. On the Thursday at school, whenever they announced that they were sending home Chromebooks, I realized that schools actually had a possibility of shutting down. I didn't think that it was going to do that. But after that, I realized that they were actually prepping to shut down. And that was whenever I thought that the virus was like for real. I miss that at school I could see my friends like every day and like talk to them in person. Um, I kind of like what I said on day two, but um, Zoom meetings, you can't talk to your friends just by themselves. You talk to the entire class. It just, it's different. It's, it's not something that I'm very used to or I think that I could do long term, like this online school but um, it's, it's just different. It's weird, like, working in your own house. What I didn't realize about online school is that the social connections that you do make at school are very important, and it's very important to keep those up and being able to talk to other people and whatnot because you eventually just kind of get bored with online school. The situation is just very unique and um, we just got word actually that we're, our school's going to be delayed until April 20th, which means that we're going to have an entire month of April to get adjusted to this as well, if not longer, if they cancel like the entire school. It kind of sucks that we're doing this for the rest of the year because I thought I would enjoy this more than I would the like actual school, but there's they both have their negatives and positives to them. They're both essentially just two different entities, and um, it's weird. It's just not what I'm used to, and I'm pretty sure no one is used to it. Like I texted my friends and they didn't like it either. So the teacher that did it right. I would say that would be my math teacher because she recorded all of our lessons so that we could watch them every day and then she had optional Zoom meetings if we had any questions or whatnot and so we would just comment on class um, to get attendance done and we would turn in our homework every day just to see that we, that we were doing it and then she would post the answers to the homework so we could review it and so personally I just like that style of teaching.